Hello everybody, I am Professor Magoogoo Stick, and today we are going to make our own characters for animation. To start, you will need some supplies, a pencil, some paper, any kind works, and it helps to have some colors like markers or crayons. Next, you want to think about what kind of character you want to draw, so maybe just think about it for a second. I got it! I will make me! Ha! It helps to draw simple shapes, so I will first draw a circle for my head. That's pretty good. Now since we are animating in our animation box, you want to make sure your character isn't too large, so a few inches tall is probably good. Next I will draw my spiky hair. That looks good. Then we can add some more details to the body. It's better to start with the big shapes first. And my body is kind of an oval shape and then I can draw my arms and I can even draw pants, which is of course is hilarious because I don't wear pants because I'm a puppet. <laughs> Great, now I can add more details like my eyes are circles and my nose is kind of an oval and my mouth is kind of a half circle so I can go ahead and add those details now. Wow, it's like looking in a mirror. Or better, ha! <laughs> Next, you can add colors, if you have them. Ooh, that looks pretty nice. Once you're happy with your drawing, you need to cut it out. Which reminds me, I should have said before, you need scissors as well. Maybe get an adult to help you with this part. Cut nicely around the edge. Ha <laughs> ha, it's little me! Take a look. Now that you have your character finished, you can make a background for your character to play in. I think I'll make a forest because that's one of my favorite places. To start, I'll draw a line for the ground. And then I'll think of adding some trees. I'll start with the trunk of the tree. So I drew my trees and I added some leaf shapes on top. Now I think I'll start to add some color. Oh, that's starting to look good. Now we can go in and add some more color. Maybe add some colors for the sky. Maybe add a sun. Oh, I could even go in and add some more details to the grass. Oh, very nice. Now I feel that I'm ready to animate. So you get your animation box. If you are confused, please watch the last video where we went over how to make an animation box. So I put my paper and my character inside my box and here my iPad is looking inside my box and look there's little me hello so here we are we're going to tap our first picture pressing the red button and then we're going to move the character a little bit at a time remember you can use this sidebar for onion skinning remember it does not smell it's just so you can see the last picture that you took Remember, we're only moving it a little bit each time. It also might be a good idea for you to tape your background so it doesn't move around. Take a few pictures there. And then let's make myself jump. Let's watch that. Wow! I'd love to see your ideas. <laughs> 